as someone thinks of space, NASA always comes into their mind. NASA, the well-known National Aeronautics and Space Administration, is one of the most iconic agencies in the U.S. They are responsible for many working on the majority of humanity discoveries in space. NASA has the most funds and equipment to see the farthest reaches of the known universe. By teaming up with Elon Musk, NASA has unlocked many more opportunities and their potential also seems limitless now. The most recent example of NASA is the discovery on Neptune planet. What is discovered on Neptune by Elon Musk and NASA and how would it affect you? So if you are excited to know more about it well, then stay glued to the end of this video to grasp every bit of it. One of the greatest inventors of our era, Elon Musk, has opened up brand new opportunities that make the already massive organization even more powerful than before. Even the nearest planet Neptune seem to be holding more secrets that were recently discovered by Elon Musk and NASA. Here are the terrifying new discoveries on Neptune that can change everything. Whenever we think of space research, NASA comes to our mind. NASA has done many space discoveries related to space now, which is not denied by anyone. Now they have joined SpaceX, which Elon Musk founded in 2002 to reduce the cost of space exploration and aim to settle Mars in the future. The two team up to open many opportunities for space exploration. SpaceX opened new opportunities for the already well-known organization NASA. Furthermore, we know that Neptune is the only planet predicted by mathematics before it was discovered in 1846. It is 30 times far away from the Sun and the only planet which is not visible to the naked eye. In 1989, Voyager 2 reached this planet after 12 years of the journey from Earth, which has discovered many mysterious things on this newly discovered planet. The color of this planet appears to be blue due to the high concentration of methane gas in its atmosphere. The other element present in high amounts in its atmosphere is hydrogen gas. The counterclockwise winds are also seen on its surface, whose speed is about 1,500 miles per hour has also been recorded at that time, which makes a dark spot on its surface. However, this spot was not seen after five years when NASA sent another Hubble telescope for research purposes. So the dark spot remains a mystery for many researchers. The strong winds are not the only thing Neptune has, but the temperature on it is also another mystery on which much research and theories have been made. Voyager 2 has recorded the temperature of Neptune warmer than Uranus, which is an unexpected temperature than average. Normally, the scientists thought the temperature of Neptune, a distant planet from the Sun, would have very cold weather, but the result was the opposite as it seemed to be. The question is where is this heat coming from being a distant planet from the Sun? A researcher named Brian Cox also didn't find the answers to these questions. Measuring Neptune's temperature is a tricky riddle to be solved. When the Soviet Union launched the world's first ever artificial satellite in 1957, it gave humanity the chance to explore two planets that have fallen into the planetary probe Wyside, of which Neptune is the one planet. Now is a time to hold your breath as there is something strange and terrifying discovered on Neptune by Elon Musk and NASA that will blow up your mind. Moving forward, Neptune is also known as a gas giant and is one of the classes of planets beyond the asteroid belt. In the half century since the people visited the moon, NASA has continued to dig into the depth of knowledge in order to deliver on the promise of American leadership and ingenuity in space. NASA is continuously working by moving forward not only to the moon but also to other mysterious planets. No one can deny the long legacy of space exploration done by NASA. In the decades since NASA's founding, the space legacy has landed humans on the moon, to name a few, also landed rovers on Mars, explored Mercury and Saturn, and even sampled the atmosphere of Jupiter. Furthermore, we all know that NASA has launched two probes, each carrying 10 instruments, providing new information about interplanetary space and especially Neptune. Before jumping on Neptune, let's discuss what these twin probes were. Voyager 1 was the first of twin spacecraft launched by Kennedy Space Center in 1977 to reach Jupiter. Voyager 1 was set out to collect information on the satellites, interiors, atmosphere, and magnetosphere of Saturn and Jupiter. 
It took roughly 32,000 pictures of Saturn, Jupiter, and their moons and rings. Voyager 2 was launched on 20 August 1977 and actually left Earth before Voyager 1. Voyager 1 was launched after two weeks, which was on 5th September 1977. Since then, both twin spacecraft have been traveling at different speeds along different flight paths. Furthermore, Voyager 2's objectives were the same as Voyager 1 and had access to extend its mission to Neptune, Uranus, and beyond. Neptune inherits mystery more than ever thought by scientists. Astronomers never expected Neptune to look rather boring, a featureless, weatherless world in the deep freeze. Instead, Voyager revealed a turbulent atmosphere on Neptune. The fastest ever wind recorded was 1,300 miles per hour, which is about 2,100 kilometers on Neptune. This meteorological activity shows that Neptune has some internal heat, which is possibly hotter than the Uranus. Scientists were shocked at how this could even be possible. Both Neptune and Uranus are famous as ice giants. However, both the planets circle around the Sun at such a distance that they receive so little heat. Their average temperature is hundreds of degrees below freezing. According to NASA officials, the temperature between Neptune's strong internal heat sources and its frigid cloud tops has a difference of about minus 260 Fahrenheit, minus 162 Celsius. This might trigger instabilities, which create extreme weather changes. Just like other planets, Neptune also receives heat from the Sun, but there seems to be something fierce within the planet. This makes it generate more heat than it receives comparatively from the other planets. As you know, the further you go far from the Sun, the colder they are in their upper atmosphere, just like Saturn, Jupiter, and Uranus. But when it comes to Neptune, it is just as warm as Uranus. According to the physicist Brian Cox, while giving a brief on this in his BBC documentary, he explained, this source of extra heat which is generated on Neptune would remain a mystery. But is it possible that one can explain the mystery to help the other in some way? There are many endless lists of assumptions and unanswered questions like, maybe Neptune is normal and Uranus is weirdo, or something like, there might be a case that Uranus is unusually cold. As far as we know, there is only one person who keeps the guts and ability to find out these mysteries. You might understand where we are going. It is none other than Elon Musk. For any scientist, there are always questions more than the answers, and they always want to do more missions of flying than the funds available allowing them to fly. Some scientists have started planning the new SpaceX Starship rocket with its unprecedented lift capabilities and potentially low costs, which could help in exploring the solar system in this era. NASA might land a single-story unfurnished house with the help of Starship. Hellman said, you can take the advantage of the Starship architecture and be able to go to the outer solar system, which we never thought about before. This might provide a revolution to explore these worlds in a new way. Elon Musk, the founder of SpaceX, thinks of a starship as the only rocket that takes humans to Mars, where they eventually build a self-sustaining place there. But such a vehicle or rocket would have myriad other uses for science, defense, and other exploration purposes. So, what do you guys think? How did scientists discover Neptune? And what is their mission? Do you think NASA is planning to visit Neptune planet in near future? What are your thoughts on SpaceX's contribution to space exploration? Do let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. And yes, don't forget to subscribe to our channel with post notification for more interesting and amazing videos.